I almost every day have a nightmare, and even sometimes there is something that cannot be described in the world. Also, I have had experiences my dream was becoming a reality. I expected my father's death, my grandfather's death, <laughs> and I expected a car accident through a dream in advance. This temperament is inheritance of my mother because my mother have had, have had experiences these kind of things. To me and to my mother, the dream is some kind of signal and free experience in our life. Today, I'm going to talk about a dream that is not mine, but my mother's dream. A few years ago, my family lived in a deep sadness with my mother because my mother was in hospital with some tragic and serious diagnosis from the doctor that was a cancel of the stomach. My family and even my relative who I didn't know well visited my mother's room and delivered a message that is very hopeless and meaningless. My mother also turned pale and got thin more and more because of the fear. The fear is not the fear of the death, but the fear of the faith to leave from the husband and two daughters. During the time, my mother dreamed of some kind of mysterious God, like God, repeatedly. My mother said, the man is always wearing a black coat, long coat, and wearing some kind of hat. You know, it looks like sakka, that is the Korean traditional hat. And I think nowadays, looking back on it now, its features are similar to Jasun Saja, who is the man taking the soul of the human. Anyway, he always caught up with my mother in the dream and snatched my mom's arm and my mother always woke up with some pride feeling. My mother dreamed of that guy almost every day. My mother's dreams was going on and another test day was coming on. You know, there are a lot of tests and steps in the hospital to know some kind of illness and cancel for fast food. Before, a few days before another test, my mother also dreamed of the guy. In that dream, my mother went over and over again because she didn't want to be touched by him anymore and she didn't and she really wanted to escape by him. She ran without any consciousness and any thought and finally she found some kind of house that is wooden house. So she thought, oh, I should hide myself into that. So she rushed to the house and opened the door and Enter it immediately and close the door tightly and start to tremble because this is the first time she escaped from the hymn. Looking around the house, she discovers some kind of white bed, and on the bed there are three people. Who are they? This is my father and I and my younger sister. My mother read herself three of us and hide herself. But the God discovered my mother and appeared suddenly in the house and stepped forward in front of my family. My mother thought this is the last opportunity to do better life to him. So she waiting for some kind of comment about him. He said this place is not yours, so you must get out of here. You must come with me. My mother said, Oh, please, please, how can I do that? I cannot die without my family. 
I just want to live with my family as a mother and as a wife. So please help me. So please understand me. My, my mother cried and cried in the dream. And at last, the man disappeared mysteriously. A few days after that dream, my mother had another test for a cancel. And, ironically, my mother is living with us, living with my family, happily nowadays. How can she live? What happened to her? And what happened to my family? The results of another test described as I described my mother's tumor as a misdiagnosis. I don't know. This is due to whether error or mistake of a doctor and a medical science, or the favor of a mysterious man. But I believe a letter one because I believe a dream and I believe I'm a miserable thing in the world and in a dream. Please don't commit a mistake to consider my story as a fiction or liar story or something that will happen to you. These kind of things can also happen to you because the signal of a death or danger is always present in your life and in your dream. So you can change your reality through a dream in advance. Do you believe a dream? Thank you. <laughs> I believe a dream. So I hope all of you have a good dream tonight. Thank you. She is also uh, have an um, interesting ghost story.